Okay, guys. So, I didn't even, you know, do my hand thing this time. But, I went to the mailbox today and I got a few things in the mail. Y'all know I'm still playing with this damn light. Um, Lord, that's blinding. Um, I got a few things in the mail. So, we're going to, well, we're going to talk about my face first and then we're going to get to it. So, a few videos ago, I did um, one on Sephora, what I bought for Sephora, which was... The Mark, oh Lord, the Mark Jacob collection, um, Mark Jacob foundation, not collection. I can't afford all of that, but Mark Jacob foundation was on sale for twenty seven fifty. Let me make sure. I want y'all to think I'm a liar. Okay, it's not on there. Why are you in here? My receipt is it. Okay. Anyways, whatever. I think it's twenty seven fifty, or it was twenty seven fifty when I purchased it. Um. Hopefully it's still on sale. I don't know. So, um, this is the foundation that I have on right now. Um, I do like it. I think it is a very good match to my skin. Um, my face is starting to sweat already. And, yeah. Um, Oh, this isn't the one. Okay. I was going to work. We were going to do this together, but I need to remember who I got it from. guys I don't know who I got it from and for some reason I can't find my ipsy for this month and I know I did a video of ipsy this month but I don't know where it's at because y'all know I got <sighs> oh it wasn't ipsy anyway it was <laughs> it was boxy charm so we're going to spray this setting spray on my face and we're going to see if it does anything while we're on this uh, video. Now, like I was saying, I'm so sorry guys, y'all know I like to ramble, but I did, um, I think I did pretty sure too much. Oh my sis <laughs> too much I thought that was 12 inches do you see what my face look like it is drenched but let's see what happens y'all don't laugh at me okay y'all don't laugh at me um dang. I did Marc Jacob and then Lord it's this side here too it was too close too close. I don't think my chin got anything. Oh lord. We we just we I'm not doing this over again. So y'all just gonna have to see me in the raw and the process that I go through to try to figure this out. So Mark Jacob is what I used for my foundation. Um this artisan palette is what I used to do my eyes. Um which came in the Tribe Beauty Box. If you have not seen that video, you can go ahead and see that video. That one has been up for maybe a week or two now. I don't know. Um, but that was in the Tribe Beauty Box, which is a bi-monthly beauty box. Um, for my blush, which I don't know if you can tell I have any on or not. Especially with this craziness. Um, I used the ColourPop um, that I got um i don't know if that video is up that video should be up but um it came in the uh down in new orleans tiana bundle um i'm not gonna open it and show that and i don't know if you can see the um highlighter that i have on probably not at this point but i got it out the sleek palette 
Um, I left my lips bare um, just in case there's something in this bag I can use. Um, if not, if it's not too loud because with my eyes, I don't need anything else crazy. Um, and I'll probably do a video after this going over my makeup. Maybe not. You know, y'all know I'm still learning. Y'all know I'm still learning. But my nose do look kind of smaller a little bit. Um, I did contour for y'all today. The only thing I did not do is um eyeliner because y'all know how i feel about eyeliner and i did not want to mess up this makeup so let me see if this lighting is going to make it any better probably not but those are my eyes um or that is my eye and this one is my eye i don't know if you can see all the color or not but i really do like this eye i do i do y'all know i struggle like, I, I, I really, really struggle, and I try not to struggle, but I really struggle um, when it comes to makeup, period. I did try to con um, use, um, what is it, contour? Yeah, I, I, I don't know, if, but I don't think you can really tell. And I don't know if I'm doing it wrong or what, but I, I did put it on. I did put it on. Anyways, back to this video. I ordered something. I didn't realize what it was that I ordered until after I ordered it to look it up. But I ordered from Soul Susan Cosmetics. I was looking up K-Beauty brands because I want to do a K-Beauty box. Because for some reason, Korean people have... The ones that I've seen have beautiful skin. I've never seen one that hasn't had beautiful skin. Now, that doesn't mean that that is not possible. But I'm just saying that I haven't seen any that had beautiful skin. Um, sorry, guys. I need to go on my roof because for some reason, no matter what I do in the attic, it seems that it wants to leak. So, I have to get on the roof. Oh, Lord. Anyways. So, I am was trying to find a box for K-Beauty. Um, there is one that I did see, but I don't know if I really want that one per se. But I am looking for a nice K-Beauty um, subscription box. So, as I was looking, I just added a few things on because I'm retarded. So, Soul Susan Cosmetics was one of them. I did not realize Soul Susan was a brand in itself. Um, when I ordered it, but it was. Um, I will leave that information down below in the subscription box of how much it was. Um, and I think if I have it correctly, this might be the one I bought three months worth of subscription. Um, I might. If not, I'll leave it down below in the description box at some point um, after I put the video up. So, the first thing that came in here, and I haven't really, I haven't opened it. I opened this here because I don't want to show you all my address just in case I don't know anybody coming. But, anyways, um, is this came outside the bag. It, this is Jelly Pong Pong Cosmetics Vacayscape Crease Proof Eye and Cheek Palette. Vegan, no talc. No gluten, no mineral oil, no parabens, no phthalates, 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 I apologize, um, hypoallergenic and non-comedogenic, non I don't know what that means neither, and it's cruelty free. Um, make a splash with this crease proof long wearing palette that comes with six super saturated eyeshadows and two buildable illuminating blushes that will take you from daytime to playtime in seconds. The intense non-chalky shadows are infused with micro shimmers perfect for a glowing holiday look and it's formulated to be crease proof and safe and easy to apply so you can get on with your vacay fun. So let us open it. And y'all see, I tried, I'm, I'm, I'm learning how to position my camera because I, I'm not about to uh, redo things that I've already done on here. But, as y'all, well, as y'all can tell in my past videos, I'm very much a big girl. And you can tell I'm a big girl now, but it's worse with the camera being down and looking up, at least to me. Um, so I'm trying to learn how to do it to where I look. A little flattering a little flattering so yeah 
Okay. All right. It wasn't that hard to open because y'all know I will tear up a pool box. Okay. And it looks this. Okay. And it looks the same. And it has the same things written on the back as well. I don't even know if I showed y'all to where y'all could actually see. I hope y'all can see that. And, ooh. Yeah, this is this is a play one. This is a play one. As you see, it has a nice mirror up here. And those are the colors. I Beautiful. Beautiful colors. Beautiful colors. Things I wouldn't have bought myself looking at it, but beautiful colors. Um, okay, I don't want to bend it back too much, but this is Water Nymph Mermaid Nyad Sabbatical Retreat Stress Free. And the blushes come in Spring Break and Summer Sweat. So that is what that looks like. This is beautiful. So, that is what that looks like. Y'all know I need to start taking pictures and putting on my Instagram because I have not opt. been doing that. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go back and do it for this month's stuff. I'm not going back before then because the month's over. But okay, that is number one. The next thing in here is. So, Susan Cosmetic is Light Odyssey Highlighting Stick. Okay. And it's So Susan Cosmetics on Instagram. Um, I do need to follow, follow her. The num the color is uh, Amarathine. 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 I'm sorry. Um... This is the packaging when you take it out the box. And this is what the box looks like. And then that's the packaging, which is different and it's cute. Oh, and this is what it looks like and the color. Now, I don't know what is trans is, um, spiraling to you guys, but that is really pretty. It's a marbly effect of peachy pinkish. And uh, let's see how much we get here. You get that much in there, which I think is a nice amount because it's not something you put all over your face. It's just. It comes a. Uh, it's a gold. It looks gold. One. Hmm. I like it. I really do like. I really do like. Um, let's see if we do it on our hands. There we go. You can see it looks a little gold there. And then if you turn it up, it looks peach. I like this. I like this. I think this is really beautiful. I don't know how I'm going to, if I'm going to use it too much, but I do like it. That's number two. So there are four things in this bag. And it comes in this actual makeup bag. Which I really do like. Now as you know this is the first time getting it. So I don't know if it's going to be like this in every um, bag. Subscription bag or whatever. Um, but yes that is what it looks like. It's very thick. Very thick. Good quality to me. Um... Let's put you back in here. And then the next thing is this says Jelly Pong Pong Cosmetics Nebula Intensely Foiled Spongy Eyeshadow. Hmm. Yeah, I know I do like eye stuff, but I, I really don't want something that's full of eye makeup. So I'm. Ooh, look at that. That is a beautiful bronze color. And I love the pattern that's in it. It looks really pretty. Almost wavy-like. 
as you know this whole thing is cruelty free as well um I guess Susan and Jelly Pong Pong works together. Jelly Pong Pong. Lord, that's something you're going to remember. Um, ooh. That is the color there. A bronzy color. And it, and that's just one swipe. I don't know how good y'all can see it, like I said before, because of my lighting situation. But we will get it together and figure it out at some point. I am going to actually look at lighting, so real talk once I get a few things done. Um, so that is that, which is really pretty. I do like it. Um, I don't know why they said it was... Oh, I don't know why they used the word spongy. Child, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That is number two. So you get four... One, one... Well, in this, the makeup bag is um, considered an item. Um, which we all know when I have the subscriptions. It is not an item. But hey, in this one it is. Yo, 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 you're doing too much. You're doing too much. Ass wipe for no reason. Get you back in there. And then, last but not least, is this. This is a tr triffle, trifle cosmetics eye candy. It's a highly pigmented eyeshadow duo. And that's what this looks like. Let's take it out of wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay, I can get it. That is what it looks like. Which is a bluish grayish color and a goldish bronzy color also um, huh. it does swipe well though these two colors here yeah it does swipe very well um, and that is that I like I said I did not realize that this is a sole one person company when I did this um, but I can't say that right now I am mad um, I don't know how I did this if I did this monthly or if I did it that three month at a time now if I did do it three month at a time I probably would just do it that three months um, and, and leave it at that I do like it though um, this bag, the October 2019 bag, is worth $104. Um, yeah, I got nothing in, in lip because I was, you know, waiting to put something on my lip. But this is, the makeup bag is limited edition. Um, the Nebula... Take these out this bag. Um, they say this is worth twenty-two dollars. Um, I think that's a bit much. I mean, I wouldn't pay twenty-two dollars for it. No offense. Um, Light Odyssey is worth twenty-six dollars. Um, I mean, I wouldn't pay twenty-six dollars. Y'all know I wouldn't, but I can kind of understand maybe a little bit. Um, a little in that range. I do think it might be a little pricey, but I also think that it's going to last long. And so you probably get more than 26 uses from it. So you can also see it as being a dollar a use. If that makes sense. <laughs> I ain't got good sense, but I'm so serious. It's like a dollar a use. Um, the... 
VK VK Escape palette is worth $32 um, I do see why this is worth the most out of all of these items um, and I think this itself might be worth around that amount and I did not even swatch this one here and I swatched everything else um, this I kill uh, candy and galate 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 oh Oh. oh no 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 wait 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 whatever this is the eye candy this is worth twelve dollars or fourteen dollars and it literally says twelve slash fourteen so I don't I don't, <laughs> I don't know I don't know I don't know but um let's see with I wanna Ooh. Okay, get rid of those three. Okay, those are the swatches of these six colors here, which I think they swatch very well. Um, very well. So, with the swatching like that, I don't see why, you know, you wouldn't pay the amount of it. Y'all know I would not pay that much because I am very much a bargain shopper. But I can see, and especially with it being eyeshadows along with blushes in here. Uh, and those two are the blushes. So... Okay, all right, all right. And I mean, just to get, it is not leaking that much, guys. I just am one that has to keep looking at things that irritates my nerve. Um, and to see here, like there's remnants of some, so it might stain. Um, I don't know, but to say I'm going to say I didn't it's not 30 something dollars a box so I think this palette itself would kind of pay for this whole package um, and you do get four items in here along with the bag the bag is the fifth item um, it comes to a value of a hundred and four dollars and that's what it looks like in case y'all want to pause it, well, if I say pause it and read it, but then you got to read backwards, and I don't know if any of y'all can read backwards. But, um, yeah, I, I think for what I got, I think it's worth it. Um, like I said, I'll put all the information down below in the description box, um, if you're interested. But I think for what I paid, this was worth it. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, um, yeah, I know I like to ramble and talk, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you will look at least take a look at the site um, because I think in itself to even just look at the site, you know, this palette does very well swatching and it's 32 retail, but just to get the bag, I think would be worth it. Even if you get just one bag to see how it is and check it out yourself. So that's it for this video um let me go get this information and i will let you guys know everything about this box or bag that i know of in the description box and you can leave you know look into it yourself thank you guys for watching and until next time talk to you guys later bye